miracle Mets. It wasn't a miracle. It was very good ABC baseball and good pitching and great defense, great defensive center fielders. We believe that we could make the miracle play. Welcome to Shea Stadium for the third game of the 1969 World Series. Tommy, uh, he seemed to be all over the place at that game. Uh, that's whole series. I mean, no matter where you hit the ball, Tommy was right there. The wind is rippling the flag, ripping it out a little bit here at Shea. It was something out of a kind of a movie. All even at one game each. The two teams having split the two in Baltimore. The first threat of the game now for the Orioles. Mets are leading three to nothing. The Orioles have runners on first and third, two down, and Ellie Hendricks to batter. In my career, I never hit the ball to left center. There's a drive in the deep left center. Racing hard is A.G. What a drive! Help A.G. Saves two runs. I didn't, never thought I was going to catch that ball because I was so far away from it. I was playing right center field, really. But when it left the bat and I saw where he was, I said, well, it's a double, and if you get by him, you know, it's a triple. The Shea Stadium has a circle with the wind kind of a thing, and uh, a lot of times the wind will hold the ball up, you know. On there, that ball would have fell a long time before I got to it. A lot of white showing. Look at that ball. Boy, he just had that one, Lindsay. Standing ovation for A.G. as he comes in. I was between first and second when he caught the ball, and I just dropped my head. On the way back to the dugout, I kept saying, how did he get to that ball? Why was he playing there? The bases are loaded. Two men are out. It's the tying run at the plate. Paul Blair is there. He's flied to center, struck out, and popped his short. Nolan Ryan in to do the pitching. The second one wasn't as tough, I don't think. And it is a fly ball. It'll be tough to get to. A.G. is going, and A.G. takes it down. I had drifted a little bit, and then the wind took it away from me, and then I had to, at the end, run real hard. Yeah, I had to dive after the end, but, but if I had really went after it like I did the other one, then I probably would have caught it pretty easy. Now this man has possibly saved five runs in this game. He had made plays like that all year. It was routine for us to see him make those kind of plays. This time with a base is loaded in two out. A skidding stall and another standing ovation for him when he came in. Jerry Grody waiting for Tommy Agee. The final score was the New York Mets. Five runs, six hits, no errors. Baltimore, no runs, three hits, one error. It was Agee's day. You can imagine what it was like for the people, the fans, etc., who had been on the ride through the entire season and seen what he did. If you win World Series for five or six times, I don't think you will ever find the town to, to react like 1969. It was kind of thing like, you know, you wanted it to happen forever. <laughs>